So hello here again for the second video, just to view what is inside this M4A, sorry, M5A1 vehicle. Uh, as you can see, there's a lot of spaghetti going on here. So let's start at the front end. So it has the original motors in place. Now, uh, as you can see, I've had modification on both sides. I had attempted to put bigger motors in, but uh, unfortunately, the Tamiya system doesn't cope. So it's gone back to stock. They are 12 volt motors, 7.42 system. So, so uh, if you guys wanted to do something with that, that's all fine by me. Heat synced everything. I'm running a fan. The fan's on at this point in time for prolonged use. Um, there's a servo up here for the bow gunner, as you can see in there, and the light's running. Now the Tamiya system is for an M26 Pershing. Uh, it was the closest I could find. Uh, I've used Tamiya in the years gone by, and that's why I chose to do that and got it up and running. Now, <laughs> six by two. This brings the sound of the sound card out of this Tamiya to an incredible level. Uh, uh, when you get to hear it, it is very loud. I've perforated holes in the top of the turret to uh, accentuate the sound through the top. Drive motor here for the turret's been replaced, the old Chinese one, and I put a Tamiya motor in, and the difference is profound. The speed's a lot more faster than what it was before. Um, cable up here goes in for the firing unit you can't see it on the previous video it doesn't show it up but uh, you can see the flash of the main gun as you can see some of that white metal componentry has been fitted to the drivers off and on switch up the back here is the power cables uh, fused of course I have a fuse running fuse 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 and here is a five volt regulator for the fan to run. At the back here, an Australian made uh, 7.4 volt uh, smoke system. As you can see, it's plugged in with brass and running. I use the old storage box for the two inch speaker as a bit of resonance, works really well. Uh, the Turnigy uh, receiver, eight channels, all being used. I've marked accordingly as done. Um, so there you go, ladies and gentlemen, that's it in a nutshell. All working very well. Uh, oh, something I forgot to mention, spare cable here. You'll see in the photos that I provide, um, you can fit uh, the driver in with an animatronic head that turns left to right if you want to use it for display. So that's it in a nutshell. Looks like a spaghetti farm, but uh, it's not. It works really well. Um, real happy with what I've done, but if somebody wants to do more in the future, by all means. Uh, thanks again.